very recently i was reading some of the articles in the research papers in the internet i saw literally there is nobody called straight if you think you are straight you are middle class mediocre your physical identification that needs just a simple medical examination nothing else physical examination nothing else but physiological identification you need to look in whenever you feel excited or you more in kama or moha understand both of them are different in kama you just want to manifest the reality of you and the other person or persons involved in your life in moha you just want to exploit everyone for your pleasure there are two different things in kama you are very sure you want the completion for everyone involved in moha it is all about you feeling complete i should not even use the word complete you feeling relieved listen carefully whenever your physiology is pressured if your psychology feels calm it is integrity you will be such a beautiful being whenever your physiology feels pressured and your psychology feels moha you will just be exploitative it will be more or less like a masturbation with another body or a rape that's it understand the reflection of parama shiva in you pratyagatma chaitanya the individual consciousness as a freedom to align your gender identification in the level of psychology and physiology and physical all three i wanted to make a statement by your will power you can make change your gender completely even physically ramakrishna demonstrated it sri ramakrishna paramahamsa demonstrated there was another one great yogi called madanagopala swami nadana nayagi swami he used to be called he lived in south india he was in madura baba with sri krishna with his power and will power he just manifested all the female characters in his system whole system 